Hello everybody, if you want to see an excellent example of the front piece of my hair, there it is! That's on record, zooming in makes it better. I've still noticed I've got this weird nervous energy sometimes on camera. And I'm trying to get rid of it as best as possible and that involves digging deep into myself. Hot. And I went down this weird dark road, which I'm not supposed to on holiday, but I couldn't help it. it I, I was trying to work out when am I going to give myself permission to be fully confident and be my best. So I delved into it and I wrote a short piece. It's not really a poem, it's just my thoughts, so they all just came out at once. And I'd like to share that with you, so let me go find that in my notebook. Oh, I, got, I hate vlogging, I need a tripod. Right, we're listening to this, everybody. Here we go. Confidence intolerance. When are things going to change? When fame hits? When she says yes? How about the reality that all of that won't happen if you don't activate your confidence potential? See, this is, I wrote this very quickly. How about regret? The pain of looking back? Or at worst, the pain of missed opportunity? Never to be... Uh, corrected. There we go. I told you this handwriting was bad. Left in eternal agony to never be corrected. Stop this. What's left to overcome? Brackets you. Brackets me. Leg let's go or forever shed a tear in your everlasting regret. Sad stuff, but I've had to figure it out because there isn't really any obstacles why I shouldn't be my full confident self. And I have had to get to the bottom of this. I've been thinking, you know, maybe it's when I'm successful and stuff, but then you don't need a justification or an excuse or a free pass to be yourself. 